morning guys i have quite the day ahead of me so let's get on with it i'm gonna go to my physio appointment for my concussion first i think that it might be my last appointment maybe i have like one more after this i don't really know but i'm starting with ot so like they cut it off then <coughs> i'm going to my mom's house to literally drop off a bag of butter um because me and my husband are severely lactose intolerant so we use a special butter and my mom is cooking thanksgiving turkey and like some of the veggies and stuff that go along with it um and we just want to make sure that we can eat it and we don't really expect other people to like buy a bunch of stuff for our allergies if we already have it then i have a car appointment my front tires are making like a weird squeaky squeak when i accelerate don't know what's up with that maybe she's just dirty we don't know because she has new brakes and I guess that's like when I accelerate. I'm not a car girly, so I don't really know, but let's do that. That's at three. So I'm going to go to my mom, drop off the butter, and then I'm going to go to the gym, <laughs> come home, shower, eat, pack a bag for all that stuff. And then we're going to go grocery shopping after. Busy. Let's do this. Okay, successful appointment. I'm doing really good. I don't even have to book for next week. I just have to book for two weeks now ahead of schedule, which is really, really an improvement because at one point I had to go twice a week. And I'm doing so good. I'm very, very impressed with myself. All right, I'm at Planet Fitness. It's currently 11.02. I spent a long time at my parents' house. Just visiting talking and stuff like that but now i'm gonna hit the gym and then i have to go see brett drop him off some tylenol he's not feeling very good and then uh get some money from something that we sold on facebook from him because i'm gonna use that for my car so we'll do that and then i can finally go home shower i put this like gel in my hair to do a slick back and it's literally crumbling it looks so gross so i don't really know what other girlies are using for their slick backs, but I obviously didn't do it right. <laughs> That's not fun. I came to pick up Brett at work so that I could give him Tylenol. This is the building he's working on. So we're doing that, and then I'm gonna, whoa! It was able to like zoom so differently. Anyways. We're doing that and then I'm gonna go home and shower. Okay, I have water boiling. I'm gonna just have these little noodles. I ripped all my nails off. <laughs> Cute. Uh, but I need something quick so I can quickly go and shower and then go to the car place. Oscar wants that. Oscar! Hi! I also wanna kinda look around what's near the car place because maybe I don't need to sit in there and bring my laptop. Maybe I can do some editing at like, I don't know a Tim Hortons or something nearby. So, we shall see. We'll keep you updated. I love, I love this mechanic because I just looked at my car and I was in there for like an hour reading Never Till Now by Jenna Lockwood. Highly recommend it. It's actually my sister's book, so. <laughs> um, and they just lubed up my whole entire car wheels. They lubed up my car wheels and stuff and said it was probably squeaking because it was so incredibly dry and didn't charge me a cent so love that i just walked in the house and brett got me flowers with a little note because he got me sick how sweet it is sweet i'm just a girl <laughs> anyways i've just been talking about them for the past like 10 minutes so <laughs> you know <laughs> so cute we're at Costco. Look what we found. They're $39. You pick the mode. Our toaster is completely shot. Oh, you pick if it's a bagel too. Bagel, bagel pop tart. Pop wow. Ours is shot. It keeps setting off fire alarm. It's always funny when they ask, you, did you find everything? Cause like, yeah. Like, unfortunately we found everything and more. Yeah, just peel it off. Just acknowledge how massive this bag of carrots is. 
like, this is my hand. This is a huge bag of carrots. Wow. We needed a new toaster. This one keeps setting the fire alarm off and burning absolutely everything. Whoa, babe, look at it. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my God. Ah, that's so cool. Oscar, look at our toaster. Wow. I'm just in the kitchen. I'm cutting up carrots. I'm drinking a tea. We're about to watch the hockey game, but I'm on carrot duty for Thanksgiving. So I'm setting it all up to put in the crock pot tomorrow morning. So like this is going to sit in the fridge, of course, with some water, but I'm just making my way through this bag. Okay. It's in there. The lid didn't fit underneath that thing. So we're ready to go. We have a hair dryer going in the background. That's the situation, but this is the fit. We're going on our annual Thanksgiving hike that we always do. For those of you who don't know, Thanksgiving is in October here in Canada. So that's what we're doing. Also, I have this mass pimple on my chin. Uh, we are bringing a dog with us. This is Everest. Everest, hi. Are you with Uncle Brett and Auntie Julia? <laughs> That's a really good hike. We do it every year. We have Everest. Everest did real good. She saw a squirrel at one point and just like went for it. But she did really good. We're dropping her back off to her parents. Hey, Everest. We're just getting gas. They're so loud. We're trying to have a fire tonight it's very nice out but the Canadian geese keep flying over because it's fall so they're all migrating this is my little table here it's literally just two bricks and we've let Oscar out he's in the wild but our fire's not catching very well We're just sitting in the kitchen. We're gonna go to a hockey game. It's Thanksgiving, but we're waiting for our wedding photos. We were told an hour ago that they were being uploaded and they're still not uploaded. So that's fun. Also, it's a blackout game. So I'm in all black. Don't know what that means, but it just says wear black. So I don't know if like the lights are gonna be off or I don't know. I have no clue why they want everyone to wear black, but that's what we're doing. Um, also, these flowers are still alive. They're starting to open. Let's see, they're starting to open up. So nice. Pretty. These are such good seeds. And they're comfy seeds. I didn't make an outro. This is my life every single time. Anyways, I hope that everybody in Canada had a great Thanksgiving. And uh, if you aren't in Canada and it's not Thanksgiving weekend for you, I hope that you had a good day, at least. A good weekend. Um, because we definitely did. So, I hope everyone stayed safe. 
and ate lots of turkey. And I will see you guys next time.